Andy's Adventures, putting the real big emphasis on adventure this time around. Cross country skiing, I've got my buddy Greg, who is actually very qualified to help me out with this. Give me a little bit about what your title is. Yeah, I'm actually on the Professional Ski Instructors Association of America's National Cross Country Ski Team. I love cross country skiing because on a day like today where the weather is kind of iffy, windy, blowy, you might have chairlifts that aren't churning for a little bit and I can go out and I can ski whenever I want. Um, there's so many snow parks throughout Oregon and Southern Washington and you have more distance between you and everybody else. So in this era of COVID, cross country skiing has been it. And it's a great workout, isn't it? It is a wonderful workout. I mean, we know that it's one of the best cardiovascular fitness workouts that you can think of. How fast can a, a typical person learn to cross country ski? Typically, uh, Nordic centers are giving lessons that are an hour and a half long. And after I teach a lesson, people are out skiing for another hour to two hours on their own. I've gone cross country skiing a handful of times in my life. I think it's time for a tune up. Can you give me a tune up today? I can give you a tune up. <laughs> roll your toe down and you're clicked in. And the rabbit comes up through the hole, grab onto the tree. Okay. Wouldn't it be more of a squirrel grabbing the tree? You're ready to go. So is this, this track right here, this was made by? This is made by him. Andy, you're doing great. Thank you. So I'm going to give you a little drill uh -oh. to try to help you. You can't just let it go if you're doing no, great. I'm an instructor. To shuffle a short little kick with your feet and then a long glide on a ski. And then shuffle, shuffle, and then long glide on your ski. On the other ski. On the, exactly. You're smarter than you look. <laughs> it, I really have, it's true blonde hair. Okay, the difference between cross country skiing and snowshoeing is the glide. Shuffle, shuffle, glide, shuffle, shuffle. I'm sure it'll look just like that when I do it. Shuffle, shuffle, glide. Shuffle, shuffle, glide. Shuffle, shuffle, glide. Normal striding, no more of the shuffle, shuffle, glide. Just stride and glide, stride and glide. All right, Andy, your first downhill on cross country ski. I wanted you to crash. I know you did. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. This worked out. I mean, the wind isn't here. The snow's falling lightly. Oh, there's the wind. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah. I'm gonna have washboard abs by the time this is over with. You should. Is it just for you, just kind of being out in this? Exactly, like for me, the freedom of being on a trail, the peace and quiet, the beauty of today is this fresh snowfall. There's just an extra level of quietness that I get when I'm out here. It's great. 